You clear it up? Is your sound on? Well, you don't, yeah, it's on. Turn all the way up. Yeah. We should, why don't we ever use this? Do you know that, what we that should, does not plug in? Do you guys computer. know what we should do? We should just use this because it makes us look like we're super suave professional. Hello. Hello. Got a hot mic. Testing. Hot Testing. mic. <laughs> buzz, buzz, buzz. Ow, now, brown cow. All right, let's just make sure that we are live in Six Figure Fitness. Hi, everyone. If you can hear us, see us, maybe. Hang yes, on. there we are. <laughs> okay, perfect. Hi, everyone. Happy Wednesday. Happy hump day to you. Adam and Ashley here. And uh, just want to welcome folks that are popping on. And you guys, we have a special, we have a special treat for you tonight. So hey to the uh, to the NLS fam. Uh, what's up, Morgan? Morgan and Grant. Hi, you two. We can't wait to talk to you guys and hang out again. I know. It's we got an invite to little Ren's oh, birthday party. Place. We're excited for that, by yeah. the way. Yeah, it's going to be good. What's going on today? Well, I just found out because you guys, we typically, we exit from an elevator in our office when we're done with our webinars. <laughs> and Ashley took the little whiteboard with her elevator button on it to work. Sorry. So might have to make a new one. Or just imagine. There's like 14 people. I know what I just said there. It's true. People are coming on. Hi, Carlos. Morgan's at a Cardinals game what? and wa and watching this webinar. Do you have Morgan, headphones you. in? Good for you. <laughs> I hope everyone's week is going well. We hope everyone's week is going well. Hey, serious question. Can you guys hear us okay? Because sometimes our sound isn't the best. And uh, I think it's better if we hold this up. You're such a dork. It's not plugged in or anything, but I. it definitely adds is what I think. It does add. All right. Are you ready to be serious? Yes, ma'am. For the you know it's you know it's great is build when you get to build this business with your spouse we're so different but yet we're so alike and i feel like over time we've taken on one another's traits so i'm very like i'm very much the jokester and i keep things very lighthearted and adam's very type a and visionary and you strategic. guys i'm just faking it this entire webinar and over time we've like become one another like we've taken on each that other's is traits so there are times where i'm a little more type a and he's a little more laid back it creeps me out funny. too when actually gets serious i just like you never know how to take it you know and then when he makes jokes i'm like are you being serious or are you, or are you joking like i don't I know what to do with know. my hands yeah <laughs> anyway all right guys seriously though welcome wednesday night six figure fitness it team. just happened by the way he just snapped into it <laughs> sorry <laughs> guys look we are, we're super excited to just uh, have the opportunity to talk to you for a little bit tonight. Um, one of our favorite things to do when we uh, network with people and, and build a business ultimately is connecting with like-minded people who really see things the way that we see them, uh, who are willing to go from point A to point B uh, in whatever goal that happens to be within your life and your lifestyle. You know, we have all basically aligned within now lifestyle because we see this as the vehicle that can take us from point A to point B, okay? Maybe that's uh, having some more time with your family, you know, with your children, with your friends, um, having more, more money to do the things you really enjoy doing. And the problem with that is the way that the world does things, it's really hard to get more time for your family and your friends and the things you want to do, because in order to have more money, it costs more hours. Like we all grow up in this, in this thought process where all we know is to trade our hours for our dollars, yes. right? Yeah. And so if you want more dollars, you have to work more hours if you trade more hours. But uh, you know, so many people at the end of, of their life get to this place where like, you know, I wish I would have done more things that were important to me. Yes. And the, the thing that, that we're offering people is the opportunity to be able to afford those things that you really want without investing more time from your life because we chose to align with now lifestyle so that we could stop being the machines that we had to be in our day jobs or in my traditional business instead of being a machine we seriously chose to create a machine okay now i remember asking a handful of people this a while back when they, when they first came on and, and we got serious and the question was simple, would you rather be a machine or create a machine? And they said, well, Adam, I think I'd, I'd like to create a machine. And I said, well, that's a really good answer. And we're going to show you how to do that. Mm -hmm. Okay. And with that, 
which you've got access to in that lifestyle is a machine that you can put in motion. Okay. I've always heard all these super awesome car analogies and, uh, <laughs> They said, well, you know, we're trying to get to the top of the mountain. What do you want? Do you want to get in there and get in a Ferrari? And I'm like, I, dude, honestly, I just want the vehicle that takes me to the top of the mountain. I don't care what it looks like. <laughs> yeah. And that always used to throw people off. But we found with Now Lifestyle that it was a good vehicle that made sense, that worked not for us, but people that we could invite to the opportunity. And we put the key in the ignition and we turned it and it actually started. Okay. We put it in drive and hark, it started moving. That was good. Sometimes this man just like leaves me speechless. So it's not to deter, as we said, like you want to create, you want to be a part of creating a machine. You don't want to be the machine. That that takes a lot of work. Machines get run down. You have to exchange parts, right? <laughs> no, <laughs> well, that's don't play off of what I said. No, now. I'm, play, I'm playing off of it. No, but for real, <laughs> like it is. <laughs> this is just a real couple doing real things right now. You guys want to see something? Got my slips on tonight. <laughs> savage it's pretty great doing business in slippers on the real though but on the real i think yep. that we're not deterring people from we're not afraid of hard work and you shouldn't be afraid of hard work but the work of this business i don't want to say it's so simple but it is so simple and if you're not afraid to connect and actually help people look out because you yeah. can absolutely do it and you know, so typically on Wednesdays, we talk about convert conversion tips. So being able to take people into your business and successfully show them from point A to point B. Mm -hmm. And what is that? We talk about it all the time. Well, I'll tell you what we do. And it's going to blow your mind how complex it is. Um, <laughs> we iterate, we reiterate the three uh, first and most important videos on our uh, lifestyle, which is setting up your LCS and learning how to drive traffic to your links that are pre-built for you. That's all. That's it. Somebody write that down. It's the bare bones of the business. And I'm not kidding you guys, you know, <clears throat> I was telling a couple of people this like a little bit ago, you know, it was so awesome to have the honor to be uh, on a live webinar to all of Now Lifestyle with one of our heroes and happens to be our personal coach and mentor, the man Daniel Kump. Uh, and uh, we got to tell him uh, just how crazy fast our business was growing in, in a four month period. And we became the people, I think, for the first time that like no one even believed what we were saying. Yeah. They're like, okay, yeah, but what are they really doing? But like 300 people try to friend me and say, okay, seriously, Adam, what's your secret? And I remember when we were in previous businesses back in our network marketing days, like we would ask people that, you know, what are you really doing? Yeah. And they would say something, but then we would find out later that they were actually doing something different. And <sighs> you got, oh man, that, and that's why people don't trust anybody. Yes. And so hashtag on the real, this is what we're doing. Like, we don't, we're not some wizards that like are hiding behind a curtain and have all these secrets. Like oh. we're legitimately driving traffic and helping people. Like we set up our LCS, we set up our lead capture system, right? We set up, we, we went in, we plugged in and got our email set up and our LCS. We drove traffic and all we do when people come into, into our, into our system and want to learn more about now lifestyles, we help them do the same. I talk about it like a baby step. When people first come into this business, we ha have you ever seen a baby take their first step? No. It's awkward. They're kind of wobbly, but you're so excited for them. And that baby just builds up confidence. And over time, the baby takes a couple of steps. So that is like for us learning and teaching people how to do broadcast emails. And then the baby takes multiple steps across the room to mom or dad who have their arms outstretched. We just take yeah. people through step by step. Gosh, that could be like a 30 minute topic. You just said just sparks and just no, but brain. we just help build confidence. And so what we're doing is not rocket science. It's just, it's simply helping people get their LCS set up, driving traffic and following up. Yeah. And if you, if you give a lick about people, genuinely, you give, you give a <laughs> lick about people you can absolutely succeed in this thing. Don't go out and lick people. That's not going to help you. Well, I didn't want to swear. So guys, what we should talk about, and I don't think we've talked about this for a couple of weeks now, what we teach our team is the four basics. Mm -hmm. Okay. And we make it out as a baseball diamond. And to be honest with you, it's really simple. Okay. Um, set up your LCS, drive traffic, follow up with your leads. That equates to conversions. When you get into duplication, what you want to do is teach your brand newest person in what we call the four basics. Set up your LCS, drive traffic, okay? Follow up, get conversions. So we have 
like we're rapidly growing and we have been for a little while. And so literally, and Ashley will attest to this, she's getting annoyed by me because every time she tells me some awesome stuff going on in our business, <laughs> what do I say? Say, Ashley, just help them get set up, get their LCS set up, drive traffic. Mm -hmm. And then I'll say it four more times in a row. And he just keeps looking at me and saying, it. I'm like, yes, I understand that. He's like, no, that's what we have to do. And then I'm serious. It's very like, this is our, wait, wait, wait. This is our mission. Five minutes of uninterrupted <laughs> eye contact. But uh, I think the thing that people confuse is uh, rapid growth for some secret that's happening. Set up their LC. Hey, talking to you guys right now. Help your newest person set up their LCS. Explain the difference between free and paid traffic. Okay. Help them understand to drive traffic to their links. And then send them the broadcast email series that Ashley shot so they understand how to set up a broadcast email and what two links to use. And if you're afraid, if you're brand new to this thing and you don't. Hey, by the way, Sixto Santagato is watching. I want to welcome oh, you. Oh, what's on, up, brother. man? Welcome back from your cruise. I hope he, he and Maria look like they had a good time. They already booked their next cruise. Did they? Yes. Jealous. Love Sorry. No, I know. but um, where was I going with that? If you're, if you're new. I'm going to say it again. If you're new. And you are introducing this business, you're driving traffic and people are coming on, you know, into your business. They want to understand how to use their autoresponder, how to, you know, set up their lead capture system. And you may not know, or you may be like, I'm very new to this thing. I don't know. That's fine yeah. because you have an amazing system and the videos are already done for you with the now lifestyle system, like that show you how. So if you don't know how, go in and just educate yourself. They typically say people need to see things like, like five to eight times before it actually sinks in. Mm -hmm. And so if you're like, I'm not sure, go back and watch those videos yourself because as the more you educate yourself and the more you go through it, <laughs> your confidence is going to continue to build. And yes, like Adam and I's first follow-up with somebody was awkward. It was awkward city. Well, we didn't know what we were talking about, but they didn't know that. But over time, we've been able to, we've been able to know what we're talking about and learn it. And so you don't have to be perfect today. You just have to do something. I'll, I'll say two things here um, in kicking off the next topic that are probably going to give somebody a whole lot of peace. Right. When you talk to somebody, like if you're on a face-to-face -face, um, conference software meeting with your brand newest prospect, they don't, and I'm not trying to say anything shady or shystery, they don't, they don't know if what you're telling them is true or not. So if you're not 100% confident in your words, you're, you're, it's okay. It's okay. Okay. You're not, you're not trying to mislead them or anything like that. Obviously don't lie to people. I'm not, I'm not saying to lie to people. I'm trying to give someone peace. Like they don't know either. Yeah. And if you don't know, you can always just say, I recommend knowing. I'm just trying to explain. All right. The second thing is to give you guys a whole lot of peace. It took Ashley and I over two weeks to sponsor our first person in that lifestyle. Mm -hmm. And once that happened, it was on like Donkey Kong. Okay. So uh, Amanda had a good one. Absolutely. Maria Lilas is on. We are going to now at this time, you guys, I don't know if you guys were blessed and fortunate enough to uh, check out the amazing, just absolutely awesome interview with uh, Cole and Amanda Custer last night that Daniel did. If you weren't, I recommend you check out the replay. Um, like Joel Terrian is literally sending it out to all of now lifestyle and like his list. So that means it's a pretty it's big so deal. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> and uh, Ashley and I are, are just so blessed to be able to work with these guys. And we're going to bring on another guest, which by the way, is going to be interviewed to all of now lifestyle next Tuesday night. And her name is Jen Weeman. And I'm going to let you guys know this first and foremost, so many likes right now. Jen Weeman is like, 90% responsible for Ashley and I finding now lifestyle. She is. Had she not been involved in an online opportunity that I had not heard about from a very, very, very fine thread. We are not talking to any of you guys right now. Okay. And we don't take that lightly when we have guests like Cole and Amanda and like Jen, mm -hmm. um, because these people are amazing. Okay. If you want to learn some stuff tonight, like get your notebook out. Okay, watch the replay of this. Share this with your people because if you guys want to hear some mad value, like Ashley and I, we're just gonna be quiet and and <laughs> ask some serious rock stars exactly how they're making this thing happen. So let's bring them on. All right, here we go. And here we go. 
<clears throat> Whoa, there, there they, they are. are. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hello. What's going on? I'm just oh, watching I'm you. Excited. <laughs> just watching you guys rock it. I love the whole team. Like, you guys are just like hilarious together. Oh my gosh, you guys should have a sitcom. <laughs> we have a yeah. vlog channel, but like my mom and my aunt watch it, and that's yeah, about yeah. it. So, we have, we have seriously like 14 people that love our, our vlog. And my grandma. Yeah, and so that's why we keep and doing our neighbors. It. Yeah. <laughs> so, guys, welcome. We're so excited to have you on. I don't know. We've never had this group on before. No. So, this is like first time. Awesome. Well, we're just gonna we're gonna ask you guys some questions and ultimately we're just gonna let you guys share the six figure fitness team and not lifestyle because you're kicking butt. Like literally Cole and Amanda are like making a couple thousand dollars in a week in that lifestyle. Mm -hmm. Okay. Jen Weeman is killing it. She's just awesome. Like what what's going to happen with you guys is you're gonna reach the goals that you came on board to go after and get, right? And so to start off with, um, so Jen, you know, what was it that you saw in that lifestyle that made you say, all right, I got it no more. Well, first of all, it was you guys. I mean, I have worked with you guys in the past and I, I knew the integrity that you held and that spoke volumes to me before anything else. Um, so Props to you guys for just holding your heads high and um, giving true value to the people who come to you for value. Um, I watch your blog. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I show Josh, I'm like, look at these crazy cats. And he, well, of course, he knows you guys. So, but um, yeah, first of all, first and foremost, it's, it's you. It was the people behind this. And then when you explained, you know, who Daniel was and you introduced us to him, that was huge for us. He is he is an amazing person. He is truly who he says he is. You know, there's no, there's no mask before him. That is who he is. And then, um, Joel, like I just, you guys had such wonderful things to say about him and I've not seen anything different from him, but what you guys have said, you know, just, I just see true value in the, the people in this company. And that's huge to me. That's somebody, that's something that I can trust and that I can encourage other people to trust. That's so number one, it was you guys. And then the second thing was, um, I am a stay at home mom and that's what I've aspired to be. I've gone from running big businesses, lots and lots of stuff to I'm ready just to be home with my kids. They are my number one thing. And I think I said to you guys, you guys, I don't want to I don't want to undermine the value of where I'm at with my family by coming into this business. I can't jump in and do a million things and be expected to give all of my time and take it away from my family. And you guys were like, absolutely, Jen, we are going to meet you where you're at. We're going to run with you where you are. And you guys, that is exactly what's been happening. I've been able to build a business that is on automation where I'm working less than an hour a day. And when I've said that before, I didn't realize that I was probably working more than I thought that I was working. I was just considering it something else, you know, and, and in this, I truly am. And that's, what's exciting to me is that it's not cutting back on the value of my family. It's only enhancing the value of my family and the time that we have together. And I've been able to build an amazing team and still give value to my team. But through the automation of this system, I've been able to teach them how to do the same. Like mm -hmm. you don't have to work. I know people come in with plates that are so full and I don't want to add 50 more hours a week to their plates. Mm -hmm. I want to ask them to stop everything else that they're doing. I just want to add value to their life. So that's the second thing. And, and there's so many other things, but I'm sure Amanda and Cole can add to that. <laughs> well, you know what? It's funny because Ashley was kind of a couple of weeks ago, I guess, like less than a week and a half ago when you came on board, she's like, you know, she really wants to take this at her own pace mm -hmm. and ease her way into it. And I actually kind of laughed at that. And I apologize for laughing. <laughs> I knew once you saw the power of our system, it wasn't going to be something that you just toyed around with and you were going to take it really seriously. And that's exactly what you did. But you're not lying when you say you're not spending all day and night building this either. 
Mm -hmm. And that was an awesome power behind that. So not that I didn't believe you, Jen, but I didn't believe you. <laughs> <laughs> well, when I go into something, I do go all in, but I also have learned um, that my family is number one yes. and that's, and I am so thankful to be on your team where you understand that and you value that as well. You take my values on as your own. And I think you do that with everybody else that comes in your team. And that's, that's amazing. That's not something you find in every, every opportunity. Sure. Well, I think the thing that happens is people like you come on and add so much value to what the ideas and the principles that Ash and I already stood for that we just want to get out of the way and give you as much of a voice as we possibly can because you deserve it. Mm -hmm. And because obviously, you know, people as awesome as you and Cole and Amanda, like I'm not, what is that notification? Sorry, it's for my yoga. Ashley's got a yoga <laughs> Hashtag real life. Yeah. <laughs> I was hoping that was like a personal sign up or Sorry, something. Yeah. Anyways, but uh, you know, iron sharpens iron. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, from the first time we spoke with you, Jen, a couple of months ago, we just felt right about, well, now what are you doing? <laughs> Nobody can see our screen. I was just exiting out of we it. We just felt right about uh, connecting and, and locking arms and doing business. And then really, when you introduced us to Amanda and Cole, it was just like another amazing element to that exact same thing that, that we've always wanted to build. It's just that we were lacking the vehicle to go reach the masses with the right team until very recently. Mm -hmm. And uh, so you guys, anybody that's watching this, anybody that watches the replay, do not miss Tuesday night because Jen Weeman is going to be interviewed by Daniel Kump. And if you guys don't have a notebook, hey, I'm not sharing mine because I'm going to take notes. And I'm not typically a note taker. You are not a note taker. Anyhow. <laughs> yeah. Actually, in, introduce our next couple that needs no introduction, by the way. Because like everybody knows who you are, I feel like by this point, right? I mean, I don't know. I just feel like I don't deserve, we don't deserve this much attention. <laughs> no, but, but I, we, are, we want to help as many people as we can. So as if I have any sort of value to share, then I'm all about it. So I'll so spill it. <laughs> I love well, it. I do have a question to start with, unless you've got one. I was just going to introduce Cole and Amanda. Do that first. Sorry. <laughs> I mean, I can't, type you guys, if you're, if you're a part of the six figure fitness team, or if you're viewing this video, maybe it makes its way out onto now lifestyle or, you know, through our, our team, the three LE team, like yeah. you have no idea the pers like the perspective that's brought here. Something I've learned over my years in, in corporate America is perspective is powerful. You have a stay at home mom. You have a couple, Cole and Amanda, who work online full time. And Adam and I currently both work full time, traditional business owner, corporate America. Not forever, though. These two right here will be joining. We'll be joining these guys down here and this lady over here, wherever they are on the screen. <laughs> but the leadership that's forming up with this team is awesome. I have never been more encouraged by the people that we've been surrounded by. And I want you to know these people get in their back pocket. Jen, Cole, and Amanda yep. get in their back pocket. Uh, Daniel uses the term often. It's called don't be an asshole. Yeah. Somebody who asks questions and then you don't do anything <laughs> with the information because these guys are some of the most servant led people I have ever met. They will literally walk through, well, yeah, they'd walk through fire for you. I could just say I'd that. run like, quickly through it. I would, I would at a brisk walk. I mean, if, if there was a way around it, I'd lead them around. It. Yeah. So <laughs> there, there it is. <laughs> we, would, yeah. we would navigate it. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Um, but we would definitely be like, come this way. Yeah. Yes. Like, right. Yeah. yeah. So Cole and Amanda, you guys killed it last night yeah. with Daniel. I would they just gave say life to it. We should say that life, honey, <laughs> give it life. So for anybody who missed last night and you guys dropped tons of nuggets, what is something that you could say to the most brand new person who's coming on board, who is like, maybe is like frozen. Like, I'm not sure what to do. How would you encourage them? Every, do you oh, want to? I went, sorry. Go Cole's going to lay it down. You can't mess up. Oh. <laughs> Just do it. Mm -hmm. It's got to start. And, and if you start, and mess up, you can fix it. 
You're not going to, nothing's permanent. The one thing that I like about Now Lifestyle is that it's so, it's set up in an order of importance. Like you guys have your bases. That's what I always tell people is there's only three things that you need in order for this business to be successful. One is traffic. Two, a landing page. Three, emails. That's it. That's all you need. And it's already there. It's already done for you. If you want to get in there and fiddle with the emails and personalize them, by all means, do it. If you're a way beginner and you're just learning what a dang landing page is, cool, because it's already made for you. All you have to do is copy that link that says this is your link. And so it's it's that's what I like about it. When you ask Jen, you know, why did you decide now lifestyle? Why did you get into it? While our family is definitely number one in our in our you know in our life, we've worked online for a couple years now. And that's not going anywhere. Um, but for me, my driving factor is being able to truly help others find success. Mm-hmm. For me, I've gone through a few other, few more than I like to admit businesses where I kept saying, here, I have this for you. Let me help you do this. Truly wanting to help people. And each time when there were some, there were some that did great and made it like, tons of people who, you know, did great with my mentorship and me teaching them attraction marketing and these things that were just like, you know, a marketing degree needed for those kinds of things. And I tried my hardest to help people and some just, it just didn't happen for some. And when I found now lifestyle, Jen introduced me to it. It's such a simple system. Like Adam was saying, you just literally need to get in the vehicle and drive it. That's all it is. It's there for you. The key's there. Everything's ready to go. Um, And for me to be able to get on calls with people and say, do this and this and this, and look, it's already, it tells you what to do. I'm just saying it again, um, made me feel like I can actually make a true difference in people's lives. So that was my big thing. I I would agree with you 100% cool thing about this car you guys is that it's like one of those auto drives you just tell it where your destination where you want to go and it literally will drive you there (laughs) so automation on point man that was that was on point everything you guys have said i mean and i love what you said because in the past with different vehicles now you can love people and want to help people go from point a to point b Mm -hmm. but the vehicle that you've got isn't moving it's really it doesn't take very long for for people to get discouraged or for you to not be fulfilled by what you're doing mm-hmm. and i'll tell you for the first time we are at 100 percent total peace with exactly where we're going based on the direction that the people that we care about are going mm-hmm. yes so it's now here's a cool thing so jen actually you kind of watched ashley and i for a little bit i think right um, and we did not, we did not chase you. Um, we're very thankful that you did come on and we love that you did, but, um, we didn't chase you. And I'm curious from Cole and Amanda's perspective, what drew you into what was it, what Jen was kind of getting involved in or were you watching or how did that happen? Well, Jen had been planning our internet takeover for a few months. <laughs> we were both. Both having, <laughs> we both had these same just sort of things that we wanted, um, and just you know, I adore Jen, and and I think both their values kind of align, and um, and so we had been trying to figure out what are we going to do, you know, how are we going to work together, how are we going to help people, um, and when she met with you guys she immediately messaged me she said amanda you you got to check it out you got to see what they're doing and i was like okay (laughs) i'm all ears what is it what are they doing um so yeah were you guys like do you guys remember pinky in the brain yes jen what are you doing tonight (laughs) like (laughs) planning to take over the world it's like it's like you still kind of tell adam watches once in a while Except Jen, like, would never, like, Jen is, like, the most genuine person. <laughs> she is. Like, well, want, Pinky, to... G- okay, you guys, if you ne- throw me up a heart if you remember Pinky in the brain, I'm just saying, I'm not the only one. I don't I, think mom let me watch it. Nobody. <laughs> one, 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 I got, I got a heart, okay, so I'm... <laughs> There. I love it. So I will ask both of you guys the same question. What are you, what are you most excited for? Mm, oh my goodness. There's so many things, but I, 
I love that I've been able to hop on a call and say, I know that you can be successful in this. Yeah. Like not a shadow of a doubt in my mind saying to somebody else, I know that you have tools right in front of you. They are all laid out beautifully. Just pick them up and start using them. And I'm going to show you how to use them appropriately. Mm -hmm. And I have a team that's going to help show you how. So I just, I love that. I know that I can share this with people and they will find success in it when they choose to start using the tools. I love that. Yeah. Yeah. I think for me, the most exciting thing is the team and the leadership. I think you guys are amazing. You have amazing character. They're here to help 100%. I can't tell you how many times I've messaged them like a million times a day, even just to help me through things. And, um, you know, our success, Cole and I, is a direct reflection of the leadership between Adam and Ashley and also Daniel Kump. So um, that makes me super, super exciting. Yeah. How about you, Cole? I, I honestly, she answers for me well. <laughs> <laughs> we're, all, we're, just like, we're, we're just on the same page most of the time. And, I tell and, her to think. Yeah. She told me. <laughs> I put that there, and then she's like, I'm also just going to say it. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. That's awesome. I'll tell you guys, Ashley and I, one of the, the greatest blessings that we've had in our fourth, going on fourth full, March, April, May, fourth full month of June. Yeah. Okay is all the people that we've been able to connect with online and what we've, the cool thing is everybody that we've connected with, they have a story. Mm -hmm. um, one thing that Ashley and I had to get better at was actually getting to the part where we explained how to set up LCS and drive traffic with our brand newest person, because we'd be 45 minutes in telling each other about our <laughs> lives. And we hadn't actually talked about how to like, do oh, yeah. business. business. Let's talk about that. And yeah. as soon as we, there were, we just had several meetings going on in a week in a short period of time, we're like, sure, so we have to get focused. Yeah. But everybody we've connected with has a story that can help somebody. Mm -hmm. They need a platform to share their story with. And that's what's so awesome about just listening to, uh, to Cole and Amanda last night and being able to connect with Jen, because there are real life people out there that, that need to hear your story and more importantly, how you've been victorious within those circumstances. Um, and there's just so many people that are silenced because they have the wrong vehicle or they, they've never learned how to build an audience. And imagine how many, I mean, you can put tens of thousands of people within our organization and now lifestyle, but imagine the millions that'll be impacted and the ripple effect that's going to have. Because one thing I've always known to be true is that dreams have ripple effects, mm -hmm. you know? And I had this thing written on my board that I just, I wrote down late last night and I asked if it came from Jen or from Cole and Amanda and it didn't come from either of them. So I was just sitting here and had some stuff in my head and it was this, what you want isn't going to fight for you. What you want, it's not going to fight for you. You've got to be willing to fight for what you want, right? Mm -hmm. That thing that you want in that goal isn't going to fight for you. You have to fight for that thing and that goal you want. If you're at point A and you want to go to point B, you got to be fight for that point B. And typically that comes down to what your why is. And I love to talk about this. Any chance I get, your why is, is so powerful because that's the thing that's going to keep you up at 11 o'clock next Thursday at night when you've got to get a broadcast email sent out for the next day. Mm -hmm. And that's, that's, man. Can I chime in? I wish you would. Yeah, okay, sorry. So speaking of why, no, no, I just want to make sure. Speaking of why, I want to give a, a huge shout out um, to somebody mm -hmm. that we were actually able to connect with last, I think it was last week, Jen. So gentleman by the name of Dennis Turner, who is brand new to the team. Great shout out. I Dennis, love that guy. Man, we got to connect with him. That was one of those calls that we were talking for like 45 minutes. We're like, oh yeah, we should probably like show you around and how to do this. And that guy has taken action and it's massive imperfect action. Yeah. And he is already running traffic. He's already having people opt into his list. And Dennis, I want to give you a huge shout out. And anybody, honestly, anyone who is watching this I right now, hearts are flying. Anyone who's watching this right now, these guys here, like we'll pop on to webinars and stuff, but we want to hear from you. And so I, I, what I want to, I, I would just love to see this people go out and taking action, hitting those leaderboards. You guys, we will bring you on these calls because we, as much as we all love hanging out, 
we are tired of listening to each other and it's only <laughs> she's, she's like, tired of me as a truth. No, but <laughs> I want to bring other people on and I want you to be able to, like we talked about, share your story because you bring a different perspective. There's something that Dennis might say, or Maria might say, or Sixto and, and his Man, wife, Maria might say yes. that will set someone else free. Mm -hmm. And we don't like to listen to each other talk. Like I, I want to like really empower other leaders to come on people that are taking action. I'm speaking it right now. Like that is going to happen. We're going to start seeing new faces and you're gonna be like, who is that? Who is this person? And who are you? Because we're really rising up a whole community of people that are coming online and gaining financial freedom and time freedom. Hey, Matt. Well, I enjoy listening to you talk. That was my type A coming out. <laughs> you guys want to hear a cool thing? So Daniel Kump um, was kind of messaging uh, us in a group thread to um, Jen and Cole and Amanda and Ashley and I, and he said, who is Shelly Davies? Oh, yeah. Jenny, last week. So shout out to Shelly Davies. Shelly? He's like, well, she is driving traffic. Getting that so yeah. I just want you to know, you got a shout out from the man, Daniel Kump. And we are watching and we cannot wait to see you on the leaderboard. Okay. Right. And for a ton of people. <laughs> Do you guys have anything you guys, I want to just, if you guys have anything to add, we'll like you've already up. just dropped a ton of gold, each of you, but uh, anything that you'd like to add? I to actually cool? want to add something about telling your story for a second. Um, I actually just got off a call with somebody earlier today who was struggling with that. She's like, but I've never been successful online. I don't know how to work online. I don't know what story to tell. And I said, okay, so if you think about your day, think about the moments in your day or in your week or in your month that are difficult for you. And think about what would happen with those moments if you were earning $10,000 a month from home. Mm -hmm. What would that fix? What would happen? And she was able to list, list off a couple of things, you know, well, you know, I'd be able to do this or I'd be able to stay home or I'd be able to, you know, my husband wouldn't be working so hard or, and, and that's your story. Your story is not like where you plan to go. Your story is where you are right now and how you can reach into other people's homes and tell them your story and, and help them connect with you. So like you guys were saying, everybody has their own thing. Everybody has their own um, I, you relate to other people for their different parts of their story. Um, and if you think about where you are right now and what's difficult and think about what earning a certain level of income from home would do for you, um, that's how you know that's what your story is. And you start telling it and talking about it. Love it. That was awesome. Thank you for that. I mean, you're absolutely right. It's so cool to just hear you explain it so plainly and so clearly, but so 100% truthfully, the way people need to hear it and receive it. So that, thank you for that, Amanda. That was awesome. You know, I think um, so often we kind of doubt ourselves in, in the words that we have to share with other, the, the importance of the words that we have to share. So like you guys in your vlog, like you're like, eh, it's just a vlog. It's just fun. It's something for us to do. Our moms watch it, you know, that kind of thing. And over the last couple of months, I've started my own blog and that's just a place for me. That's just a journal. It's a journal for me to, at the end of the day, I get my kids in bed and it's a place for me to celebrate the day. It's a place for me to, um, kind of work through maybe some hard points that I had in the day or whatever that is, but that's my story. And what's really, really cool is I'm not doing that for anybody else. I'm not writing that for anybody else, but you wouldn't believe how many people have reached out to me through text or messenger or whatever it is and said, Hey, you know, I really relate to you on this. Thanks for putting those words out there. Thanks for those verses. These are things that I'm not necessarily writing to a specific person, but something that I'm living through. So like your story needs to be heard and you deserve to share it out there. So people, people want to hear what you have to say. You're important. And listen, your grammar doesn't make a difference to anybody. It's not, it's not, it's really? I mean, I wrote an email the other night and I reread it the next day and I was like, what the heck? Like <laughs> I did so many words and misspelled and it didn't matter. Cause you know how many people responded to that email? Like five people because yeah. I, I related to them and they didn't care. All they want to know is hear what they just want to hear who I am, what's in my heart and how they can relate to me. And now we're friends. <laughs> so that is awesome. Oh my goodness. Oh, well, you want, you guys want some peace. What if you had the, the wrong dollar trial page in your broadcast emails for over two months? <laughs> oh, 
imperfect oh. action, you guys. Imperfect action. <laughs> We'll fail fast. Then. Well, we didn't fail super fast. It took a slow. little. It was kind of so. like just being drugged down a road. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, thank you so much for hopping on tonight. Um, Thanks for having us. For sure. You, sure. Your, you guys have you like you all of now lifestyle. You've only seen the very beginning of Jen and Cole and Amanda. Okay. And uh, anytime you get an opportunity to just receive their message, I just strongly recommend that you just open your heart and open your mind, open your ears and, and just that receive it because they're pouring into you because they care. All right. Like I have nothing else to add to that. We should just end it right there I know. and let everybody know that there is a now lifestyle national event coming up in Austin, Texas, very, very soon, which you're going to find more about soon toward the end of the end of the month. First yeah. of July information should be coming out. So that is going to be a power patch weekend. It's going to be rare air for sure. Rare air. Rare, rare air. Rare. Can we get the dance party started now? Oh, I think oh. we should. Well, <laughs> typically I have an elevator exit, but my oh, whiteboard's full and party. Ashley took her other, you know what I'm doing for, you know what? I got all my important information off the board. Hang on. It's like living with an 80s <laughs> sometimes. Just anybody that's interested in this. This is what happens at our house. The thing is, it's kind of like, I don't know if anybody's <laughs> that magic chef store. I'm not into magic and things what? like that, but if I draw this button on my whiteboard. He's also wearing loafers, by the way. So. I don't know, slips. <laughs> <laughs> all right, this thing is weird because like the floor falls out, but only if we do it together and we push the button together. Let's show them. It's, oh gosh. It only works okay. if we hold hands. All right. You guys, do you guys want to elevate her out with us? Jen, Cole, and Amanda? You Watch just gotta this. lower yourselves. We have to say goodbye first, though. All right, guys, we're signing off. Okay. Amanda, press the button. Woo! Later. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> you guys have a great night. <laughs> Bye.